Hello everyone, welcome to Tipo Talkies. The year 2000 was a defining decade for Hindi cinema. It saw the acceptance of one of its popular masala films for a nomination for Best Foreign Language Film by Academy. The decade also marked the debut of several acclaimed filmmakers such as Anurag Kashyap, Imta Ali, Vishal Bharadwaj and Dibakar Banerjee. A new director named Farhan Akhtar also made a breakthrough with his unique friendship film. The period also saw the rise of Khans. The decade paved the way for the development of truly satisfying films that continue to thrive today. As we look back on the past 20 years since Hindi cinema was officially recognized as 21st century industry, it's clear that these films have stood the even amidst a global epidemic. Many of us are revisiting our favorite films from 2000s. This list features my top 10 movies from the decade ordered from good to the best. These films are not ranked based on their popularity but rather on their personal significance to me. They all hold a special place and are well worth watching again. Number 10. Oi Lucky Lucky Oi Dipakar Banerjee's 14-year film career began with Kosla Ka Gosla, but his most outstanding work to date is Oi Lucky Lucky Oi. The film which stars Abhi Diol and Parish Rawal at their best is a combination of morality, teen, heist drama and character study. The film's sharp comedy, exceptional cast and relatable daily-based drama make it a unique and amusing experience. Even after all these years, the film still remains as relevant and timely as ever. I particularly appreciate the film's unapologetic emotion emotional depth and the perfect casting with Parish Rawal's triple role as three father figure being the highlight. The context of the film's release makes it even more meaningful as it was released just two days after the devastating 26-11 attacks in Mumbai. The delightful comedy and high note finish provide a much needed escape making this Hindi film about a city as universal as it is relatable. Number 9. Mansoon Wedding Meera Nair's wedding drama is a film that expertly combines Bollywood and Indian elements to explore the intricacies of family, dynamics, and hidden truths. The story centers around a bride with a secret lover, a struggling marriage, and a family weighed down by dark past. Despite the serious themes, the film cleverly shifts its focus to the celebration and joy of an Indian wedding where loved ones come together to dance and participate in elaborate celebration. Released in 2001, the film is a technical and acting tour featuring an accomplished ensemble cast led by Nasruddin Shah and noteworthy performance by Shafali Shah, Tiludu Vashong, and Radhi Bhutta. The film's examination of complexities of family and relationships make it a standout and memorable Hindi film. Number 8. Gulal Anra Kashyap's Gulal is a film that uses melodrama in an effective way to innovate its cinematic storytelling. The film tells a gripping story of college, hazing, and doomed romance against the backdrop of politics in Rajasthan. It also exposes the harsh and unfortunate reality of India as a democracy through its epic narrative. The film's observations are both uncomfortable and subtle, and it effectively eliminates any sense of humanity. Characters such as Dunki Banna and Dilip Kumar are powerful and unforgettable as they are relatable and reflective of society at the time of the film's release in 2009. Number 7. Rangde Basanti Rangde Basanti, directed by Rakesh Om Prakash Mehra, is a film that showcases unique and thought-provoking storytelling. The level of intensity and boldness that the film portrays left me awestruck when I first saw it. The film connects the struggle of young generation against oppressive government with the fight of freedom fighters against colonialism in unexpected ways. The performance of Amir Khan, Atul Kulkarni, Kunal Kapoor, Siddharth and Sharman Joshi are noteworthy, but it is the writing that truly stands out. The screenplay utilizes a combination of entertainment and political commentary, creating a film with multiple layers that keeps the audience engaged until the end. Number 6. Chuck the India Shemit Amin is a filmmaker with a talent for creating unique and well-crafted films. However, his film Chuck the India is in a league of its own. It is a true exceptional sports drama that exceeds expectation. Although the story may not be completely satisfying, the film is immensely enjoyable from start to finish. The film is unique in a way. It was one of the first sports drama to feature all women's team. It also brings attention to the unprofessional and hasty nature of the Indian media and how a Muslim man is immediately immediately labelled as negative, even when he is the captain of national sports team. The film also promotes unity despite differences. The writing is also noteworthy as the hockey playing girls are portrayed without stereotypes or background and the final game is written with such urgency that it remains an exciting watch even now. Number 5. Makbul Vishal Bharadwaj Makbul is the first installment in his Shakespeare trilogy which also includes Omkara and Heather and is considered the 
best of the three. The film is skillfully adapted version of Macbeth set in criminal world of Mumbai. The writing is polished and clever with masterful editing and cinematography. The lead actor, particularly Ifan Khan and Tabu, gives powerful performances. The film also deviates from the original play in subtle ways with underworld ties played by Nasuddin Shah and Om Puri adding a unique twist to the story. If you have reached here, please pause this video and subscribe to this channel for more content like this. And because you have, let's discuss number 4. Black Friday Anra Kashyap film provides an in-depth and thought-provoking examination of the lives of those behind the 1993 Bombay bombings. The film showcases masterful technical and performance elements, making it must-see multiple times. The low-key performance by actors such as K.K. Menon and Aditi Srivastava as Rakesh Myra and Bacha Khan respectively add to the film's brilliance. The film takes inspiration from Hussein Zaidi's book of the same name, but offers a unique perspective on the subject matter with its sharp and sensitive writing, keeping the audience engaged throughout. Even if viewers only focus on the crime aspect of the film, it is still incredibly captivating story. Number 3. Guru Mani Ratnam is a filmmaker known for his visually stunning style. However, Guru is a departure from this pattern and stands out as a refreshing change in his career. The film stars Abhishek Bachchan in one of his best performances and is a character study of the protagonist Gurkan Desai. Though not officially a biopic, it explores the rise of an ordinary man to power. The film's simplicity and depth makes it great and storytelling is not overshadowed by the energetic A.R. Rahman soundtrack. The film's strongest element is the relationship between the protagonist and his wife played by Ashwira Rai, which is portrayed in a relatable and realistic manner and the unconventional pairing of the couple adds depth to the film's plot. Number 2. Dil Chata Hai Dil Chata Hai is a 2001 Hindi film directed by Farhan Akhtar that explores the life and relationship of three friends in their late 20s. The film stars Amir Khan, Saif Ali Khan, Akshay Khanna in lead roles and features Preeti Zinda and Sonali Kulkarni as the female leads. The film is set in modern-day Mumbai and follows the lives of three childhood friends Akash, Samir and Siddharth as they navigate through the ups and downs of adulthood. One of the major themes of the film is the concept of friendship and how it evolves over time. The three friends go through different phases in their lives and their friendship is tested by the challenges they face. The film also explores the idea of growing up and the different paths people take in their life. The film also features strong performance from the lead actor, particularly Amir Khan, who delivers a nuanced portrayal of Akash. The film also features a memorable soundtrack composed by Shankar Hassan Loy, which adds to the film's charm. Dil Chata Hai received widespread critical acclaim upon its release, with many praising its realistic portrayal of friendship and relationship and was a game changer for Bollywood film industry. The film also won several awards, including National Film Award for Best Feature Film in Hindi. This film continues to be favorite among audience even after two decades of its release. Before we go to number one, these are some honorable mentions. Number 1 has to be Lagan. Lagan, directed by Ashutosh Gwarikar and starring Amir Khan, is a film that demonstrates how even a simple sports drama can be highly engaging and well executed with bright screenplay, direction, and performance. The story is set in colonial India where a group of villagers challenged the government's tax policies by winning against them in a game. However, the film is not just about sports, it also delves into themes of hope and positive aspects of living in poverty. The film also explores a love triangle which adds depth to the story and elevates the overall entertainment value. Although it is not perfect film, but it is considered a masterpiece and is often seen in recent times. Lagan is considered one of the best Hindi films of 2000s. Before wrapping up this video, please let me know your favorite films from 2000 in the comment section. If there is any specific film you would like to know more about, please let me know and I will try to create a video on the topic. Your feedback is important to me, so please share your thoughts in comments. That's it for now. And for more such reviews, please subscribe to this channel, Teapot Talk is. Press the bell icon so that you will be notified whenever the next review is live. You can follow us on Instagram, Facebook and Twitter at Teapot Talk is, where you get daily updates on the world of entertainment. Thank you for watching.